Hey friends, what's up? I am bringing you another simple Halloween look here today. This is Buddy, aka Jigsaw. You guys may have noticed him from the Saw movies. Anyways, as you guys can see, I just brushed my brows out and we're going in with the NYX Gel Eyeliner to fill in our brows. We're making sure that they're very thick, very bold and dark. We want them to stand out since we're going to be applying some paint on our face. And once we finish our brows here, we are going to go ahead and go in with some NYX White Paint Pot. You guys can use the Milk's Jumbo White Pencil and Milk. And we're going to go ahead and clean that up. We're also applying it all over the lid as a primer. And as you guys can see, we are blending that out. I am trying to make these Halloween tutorials very affordable, you guys. Um, just basically trying to use things that you might have around your house. You don't have to go out and buy anything now. Mind you, I did use some things that you might have to buy, but they are very cheap, like 99 cents. And you guys, try to remember, I'm like not a Halloween makeup professional here. I am just creating simple looks that might be easy for you guys, might be helpful if you're trying to do something for Halloween, but you don't want to invest in like liquid latex or things that might be expensive. I'm just doing what I would normally do for Halloween. And now we are going to take that same breath mix liquid gel liner, liquid gel, gel liner. We're going to go ahead and paint that all over the lid. Um, we want to make sure that we put down a nice dark shade since his eyelids are just really dark and creepy. I mean, isn't that the point of Halloween, guys? Dark, creepy, gory. <laughs> I'm just kidding. There'll be some cute tutorials coming soon, I promise. And once we have that all smeared all over the lid, as you guys can see, I am using my Melt Cosmetics Radioactive Stack. This black shadow is from the Dark Matter Stack. Um, my mom gave it to me, but anyways, you can use any affordable black eyeshadow that you have. If you do not feel like the Melt Cosmetics Stacks are affordable, some people might find those pricey. This is just what I had sitting around, so I'm going to go ahead and set that black gel liner. And this is where the paint comes in, you guys. This paint was like $1.99 at the Halloween store. This is just some white cream paint. And I'm going to go ahead and stipple this all over the face. Actually, I'm using a beauty blender. I don't know what I'm talking about. But anyways, I'm going to blend this all over the face. You could go in with a little more paint. I went in pretty lightly because I have a ton of tutorials for you guys. 13 is a matter of fact. And I didn't know how many were going to use this white paint. And I only bought one, even though I can run to the store and grab a few more. It is very, very affordable, I promise you guys. I know I'm trying to make these tutorials with just the makeup that I have at home, but I had to sneak in a couple of extra things, I'm just saying. And for this look, I needed my face to be nice, white, and pale. And I'm just taking some white powder that I have from the Halloween store and I'm setting my face. You could easily just use some translucent powder like the RCM 
RCMA no color powder. Choose set this paint. This is kind of nice makeup. It does today. Anyways, Wet n Wild came out with this awesome paint palette. The one that I'm using is this limited edition Bright Vine palette. And I'm just going into the red. And you guys know what comes next? These weird swirly circles on the cheek. You guys know that Jigsaw had these on his cheek, so we are just recreating that. And you guys will see here that I go back over top of it because I kind of want to deepen it up. And you see my circles aren't perfect. I mean, if they're not perfect, you guys, no one's going to judge you. Just do the best that you can. So I am creating these little sparkly circles that can make you dizzy if you keep working with them. Going in with that same wet and wild paint palette, we are using that same red, and we're just going to go ahead and line the lips because, I mean, why not? This is an affordable tutorial, correct? And then, of course, we're going to go in with a wet and wild matte liquid lipstick. It is from the Catsuit line. It is nice and red. Perfect for this look. Any red affordable liquid lipstick that you have, or just red lipstick. It can be matte, it can be green. Whatever kind of red lipstick you have will work. Alright you guys, we are almost done with this very simple look. We are going back in with that NYX gel liner and we are just simply drawing two lines on either corners of the mouth. These lines give you that whole puppet effect. So we're drawing those straight down and then we're going to go right up underneath the lip, back and forth, kind of smudging it to give it like a dark effect. And then we're going to go down the nose a little bit, almost like a contour, but we're going to go ahead and smudge that out with a beauty blender or maybe my fingers or maybe both. Either way, we're going to go on either corner of the sides of the nose, down, um, connecting it to the eyes, and we're going to go in with a little bit more of that red paint. You see that there's like paint missing? We're going to go on with some of that red paint, and we're going to go ahead and smudge it in, just because we want to give this an even creepier effect. And then we're going to go back in with a little bit of that black shadow and smudge it up underneath the eyes. Let's make this stuff messy. Anyways, that is it, you guys. This is my buddy, a.k.a. Jigsaw. <laughs> Makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe, follow me on all social media, which is linked down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And yeah, don't forget to press my money phrase. It is truly the best makeup you can wear. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.